Hello, welcome back. Last time I had a very capable hero who chopped a three-eyed monster into pieces in record time. Uh, I think I also killed somebody else. Nama, was it? Maybe? Uh, anyway, two remain. Um, I want to remind myself, is Ladon unchained in this timeline right now? I think he is. Uh, and I do need to reach him if I want to fight Tubal. So that's going to be my first goal right here. I believe there is a future successor's bargain on the board somewhere. I forget where, uh, but I will want to be taking that pre-Jonah. Uh, just because this particular hero has cleared so much of the castle, I would rather have the money advantage than the gear advantage for Jonah and Kane, Just because they're so convenient to fight and I don't have to... Let's see, I can infer that Ladon's going to be one of the ones on the right, probably, right? Maybe? I mean, there could be weird dungeon generation, but he's probably over there. So I'll go in this direction and see what I find. Oh, you, you took out all the platforms. Right, okay, so I'm always uh, a little stiff at the start of a session of this game. It takes me a bit to find my footing and remember how to play it. Uh, so of course I go to the hardest zone right away. Hey zombie, have some explosions. Oh, okay, so re-re-risen, not re-re-re. Right, I have wind wall. It's very good. I learned some things about using it. It's an excellent spell. And I have Sir Cat's Stinger, which is just all around really good for everything, mostly for bosses, but also for walking around. It's nice. It just feels good. And I have a saber, which can attack very quickly in the air, and quickly enough on the ground, too. And can critical when I do this. Careful. Okay, I'm being. Ah, there was a... I did not see the Voidus down at the bottom. He's hiding behind a shield. Okay, yeah, so just trying to go right. Oh, there's a crate there I didn't break. That's... that won't do. Oops. Okay, there's a, a blank, a blank, a bunch of stuff. I uh, is me taking a lot of damage. Okay, yeah, so I'm I'm in danger here. I'm being aware. Fine, as long as I play with some care. I am. But yes, health a little lower than I'd prefer. <laughs> Isn't that true anytime I'm not full? No, not really. It feels good to spend it productively. I'd like to see my health bar go down before a mandatory heal. So, you know, I want to enter every boss encounter with one HP. It feels good. But, oops, uh... I mean, if I didn't need to spend the HP, if there's nothing I can spend it productively on, then I don't need to just lose it for no reason. Still, though, I like to feel like I'm spending it productively. You take some definite attention, whatever your name is. Uh, the one that shoots the explosive blast. Uh, I always have to stop and give you my, my full attention when you're in the room. Because that explosion is very dangerous. It, it hurts a lot. That thing also homes quite aggressively and uh, takes a lot of attention on its own. Um, health getting a little low. Is this light on? No, this is... Chronocopia would be nice, but I'm a little low on resolve at this point. This probably light on? Hey, and food. Alright. Here we go. Found the dragon. He is currently unchained, right? Yes. Mouth open, waiting for me. Alright. I'll feed you myself as a snack later. I would like to... Actually, will I? Or is now the time? I guess I'll continue clearing this spot. Soul Tether's nice, but I don't have the resolve budget. I could reroll. Would I reroll away from Soul Tether? Sure. This late in the run? Sure. I'll fish for other stuff. Like Hyperion's Ring? That could let me take a potential second... Search a successor's bargain if I can find one. Okay, noted. Hyperion's Ring here in, uh, what's this place called? Fish and Dry Lake. Oops. 
Right. Um, oh, right, and I have the magma stone. What is it? Forge ember? Forge ember. I think that's what it's called. Glowing ember. Uh, whoa, a lot of stuff happened the instant I stepped into this room. Okay, and there's a re re, -re in here. I'm leaving. This place is a little too dangerous for me. Uh, I'll come back with higher health. All right. Things of interest up in that section. If I go in here, I can always bail out in the menu if I absolutely have to. I think I can probably handle this room, though. Whoa, so I plan not to have to bail out. Ah, there's just so many saw blades, though. Oops. Ah, okay. Uh, it's fine. If I took another hit from you, I would survive. Not you, though. Oh, that's sad. And there's a Hyperion's ring on the on the uh, board right there. Okay, I overestimated my uh, safety in there. Apparently the projectile from the whatever it was does more damage than the void projectile from the voidist? Hey, I reached the max rank. It's 16. Okay, so I know what the max rank is now. I assume it was 15 and I upgraded it once so that it could be better. Okay. All right, that's fine. I got a bunch of gold. Um, would have been more optimal for that to go differently, but I guess this means I can play with somebody else. I mean, I like that one a lot. She got things done. Minimalist sounds good. Yeah, this... This hero looks pretty good. That's not terrible, but I'd rather have the Valkyrie, I think. Plain old normal Ronin. I'm gonna be fine. Nostalgic Ranger. See, if I were... There are situations where I would want to take this hero. I think I'm not in one right now. Yeah, let's just go with Sir Ryan. The fifth. Okay, so. <laughs> Plans change in an instant. So do you tell me anything about having maxed out a class? No, it just says 16, so I just have to know that 16 is the current maximum. So, if I were to upgrade... Oh, my jumps are so small now! <laughs> I got used to the big jumps. <laughs> uh... Mastery level increase 1. So I'm just going to want a whole bunch of these, right? I have 700 souls, I can afford... Three upgrades, okay? So maximum level presumably is 17 now. Do I have a trial to do? Yes, but I wanted to unlock more empathies for it first. How am I doing on that? <laughs> I don't have to wait for one more. Maybe I could get that done today. Uh, and it'll be a good Valkyrie warm-up. I'm out of souls, but if I want to change this... Okay, let's look at the... Uh, what's your name? The Sage Totem. Um, what's my lowest level one? Dragon Lancer? You know what? Let's figure out how to... I want a Contrarian Dragon Lancer, but... Let's not wait for that. Hang on, wait. But also, which stat is getting upgraded? Dragon Lancer is armor. Yes. 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 I need armor. I might take a different hero if I roll a good one. But I do need to work on this. Like, this is, this is important. Prismatic Spectrum... Honestly? At this point? Let's see, Dragon Lancer has Bastion, which I'm bad at using. That's like... That's kind of like Windwall. If I think about Windwall, maybe I could figure out how to use it. I don't know which spell I prefer at this point. Magic 8 Ball is cool for bosses. Blaze Bellow I never got very good at. Searing Shot I ended up not liking as much as I thought. Windwall is nice. Gravity Beam... It feels bad because I can't multitask. I'm just stuck in place using it, and I don't think the damage is impressive enough for that to matter. Shockwave I haven't really learned very well. White Star can damage me. But you know what? Oh, jeez, I'm taking a class I don't like and a spell I probably don't like. I want to learn White Star. The big explosion could be good for, like, big groups of enemies. But will I be in a situation where I'm trying to clear big groups of enemies, or am I just going to be fighting Jonah and stuff? Well, ideally, I'll just be fighting Jonah and stuff, because this this one would take out uh, uh, the, the last two that are remaining. What do you have to say? Yes, but not yet. 
All right, I have a bunch of money. Um, I have some new equipment. I'm still very into the sanguinity. So let's at least just upgrade those uh, without thinking too hard about it. What I can do, that was all I could do. Okay, sanguine plus two, sanguine plus two. Obsidian, sanguine plus two, sanguine plus one. So I can lose the cape and put on something else. I cannot lose the vial. Okay, so if I lose the cape or the helm or the weapon, any of the three. Weapon's probably the one I'm most interested in. Ooh, kin weapon. 17 more strength. Is that the best I can get? Upgraded drowned would cost 40 more weight. Kin would cost... 60 more weight. Um, how far am I from the possibility of kin unity? Two more pieces of equipment, I think. Oh, Leviathan Cape, that's new. Okay. Leviathan Trinket, that's new. Focus, okay. Um, what did I decide? Ups uh, upgraded drowned weapon, probably. I'm thinking upgraded drowned weapon. Because, like, kin, that can wait. Okay, 6,700, 5,000. More money, more ore. Less weight, though. But I'm already chunky. See, I'm going to want kin unity. This is cheaper. It gives me the same thing. Neither one really gives me anything directly. Yeah, I'm going to go with kin. All right. Uh, so this is what I have. Sanguine unity plus... Or, sorry, Unity level 50. An Obsidian Chest for the armor it gives me. Hold up, could I change to something... Wait, hang on. So Leviathan Chest would give me a lot more armor at the cost of some vitality. Drowned would be more armor, and that gets me toward Drowned... Hold on. No, I can have Drowned Unity here. Oh, uh, okay, so cancel Kin. We're going with Drowned. Because that gives me a strength bonus. Okay, well, I'll care about what I bought there later. Okay, so I have two Unities active. I have plus 15 strength and also the Life Steal. Alright, cool. Damage I'm doing. That's not bad. That's pretty fine, actually. Yeah, it's a little slower than a Knight, is it? That does a little bit of damage, if that matters. I have Prismatic Spectrum. And that's all I need to think about. Okay. Uh, how's my rune capacity? I did level up a little bit, so it will have gone up. I have 10 to spare. Eighty-seven armor. Yeah, I, I would like more. Okay, so. Reinforced costs 40 per thing, so if I lost a 30, I could put that on. Is there a 30 I could stand to lose? Resolve, honestly. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, I'll put this on. I could buy more, but I don't have the, the whatever for it. My health's looking awfully low, so therefore I should certainly upgrade this before I do anything else. Uh, what are my traits... Minimalist. Doesn't give a gold bonus, so upgrading healthcare wouldn't, uh... Wouldn't give me better gold for this run. That's as good as, as, good as it's going to get. I think my rune weight capacity is actually a lot behind my other stats. I might want to put more into this, because that's starting to be good for stuff. Otherwise, I'd mostly want vitality, maybe armor, and strength, right? Do I have more same location rerolls? I mean, eventually. You know what? With this amount of money, now's a good time. And I could max this out. Wouldn't have much left. Um, I'll put one into it, but I want to put the rest elsewhere. Let's say... Okay, so if I were doing rune weight up, I can afford a lot of this. Yeah, I'm gonna just do that. That sounds real good. 
And then I have enough for a little bit more vitality or strength. I pick vitality, I think. Okay, 899, 93. Oh, I don't have enough to buy another rune, though. But I can put on a lot more of what I already own. Yeah, I have a hundred now to put somewhere, so put that resolve back on. I could take a dash, and also something else then. Like trick would fit, capacity would fit. I do like capacity. However, what about some of these critical ones? What if I took a little more weapon critical damage? Then I have 40 left for... Wasn't there a 40 that I wanted? Maybe there wasn't. I could take two 20s. Let's say capacity. And then... I guess that would help my prismatic spectrum barely. Those are all 30s. I can take more haste, but I'm actually okay with the amount that I have now. How would it feel, though? Actually, that's pretty nice. You know what? That works for me. Okay, uh, so... That's all my money spent. I'm equipped, so now let's go in here and uh, not be able to use any of what I just bought. Uh, Alright, so uh, this is a bunch of targets. This is a knight-only challenge. Let's... right, so I said I would get bronze at the very least before I turn on any empathies. Alright, so I'm slow and a knight now. I don't want to destroy you, because you're actually helping me. I'd kind of like those to be last. Uh, it's okay to take damage, is it? Okay, so how do I... I'm kind of just routing right now. So this route sort of makes sense. I have a fireball here, which is clearly meant to be used for that. Uh, do it... Okay. Do it when? I ran out of mana. Let's restart. Okay, so up and over is probably the way to go. I guess I'll try starting here and uh, see how it goes. If I fireball from here... No, okay, so let's let's find the sweet spot for the fireball. I need to know this. Is it right here? It is right there, right at the, the pole of that mast. And just remind me where all the targets are. I make sure I know their locations. Hmm. Now that's some pretty good upward traversal, but the way I did it actually works okay. This could also be a fireball spot, I think. Yeah, I think it's all three. Okay. Alright, so that's not bronze par. I can restart, even in the victory spot. So if I, if I use my fireball to do that, that seems pretty good. And then the sweet spot was here. I can ascend this, I do a double jump there, I do a downward sweep with my sword, I miss one unfortunately, but that's okay. I hit the water, and that's unfortunate, but that's bronze and maybe even silver? Alright, this seems highly doable. Bronze trophy, okay, so how much does silver require? I have some more souls now. I get all this empathy, but then I do it without the thing. Silver par, 1950. I can absolutely... Mm, I can maybe do that. I'm going to make a serious attempt at silver, but... Uh, when does the timer start? Right then? Okay. Uh, to restart. My health doesn't really matter here. I mean, technically it could run out, but it's not going to. Uh, getting the timing on that right is going to be interesting. I think that's how I want to do it. Was that too early? It was. Okay. One, two, 
Three seconds? Three seconds seems perfect. Ouch. Uh, I was stunned for a bit longer there than I probably wanted to have been. Alright, so nail this sweep. Uh, I did not nail that trick, but I still got, and that's just short of silver. It was like 19.75, 19.5 or something. Two, three. I missed one. Okay, these are the fun scars. I mean, they're all fun, but this one especially. Oops, okay. One, two, three. Uh, I can take that hit every time. It's probably fine. For silver, at least, I'm pretty sure it is. Uh, that lost me a little bit of... T oh, I missed one. I didn't see that happen at the start. Okay, so be a little lower for that fireball. Uh, that was good, but I missed the resonant thingy. If I do that... Uh, that was a mess. Maybe I can get away with it. I didn't take that hit, but then I flubbed up some other stuff. This might still be good. It's looking not too bad. That was actually quite clean. Okay, that's definitely silver. What's gold? Do I think I can do a no empathy gold? If it's like 17, maybe. If it's like 16 or less, maybe not. Sixteen fifty. I think I can do that. It might involve some rerouting. I think maybe maybe the, the key is just some better dashing there. Like, okay, I need to dash on the ground. Okay, hit the left side of that mast. Dash on the ground. Uh, that doesn't matter, I think. Do this dash, do that dash, and I get more something. Okay, pretty clean. Not as clean as I theoretically could be, but that was actually... Oh, that's, that's actually pretty good. That's... Oh, that's gold. Okay, I did it. With no empathy. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I should have just done that. I didn't commit hard enough to this to understand that this would be completely possible. That was fun. Okay, I enjoyed that a lot. Nice. Alright, all empathy's unlocked, so now... The one chest that would otherwise not have had money in it will have money in it. Cool. All right. Uh, right, and now I have a whole lot of haste, and it feels different. If I wanted to spend these souls... This isn't an issue until I play another knight, and my souls will stay with me. Charon doesn't take those, so I could wait. I think there are none of these that can help me right now. Accurate. All right. Okay, um, could this hero get anything done today still? Additionally to what he's done. Maybe he shouldn't. Let's make this a short day. Alright, that's fine. So, I'm gonna take this in and uh, work toward Estuary's Tubal and whatever the name is, Mahujiel's Estuaries. Um, maybe a little more of a direct route. Because, yeah, I'm kind of ready to, like, move things on. I can get to... Hold up. You know what I can do? I'm going to input a super quick try on the new whatever. Uh, and I just want to see if it's reasonably possible to take it down just immediately. So one way or another, this run will end with a fight with... Yeah, w what is the, the skeleton crew's name? <laughs> skeleton crew, yes. Right, this whole silly dance. I can just I can just get here as long as I have the Kerguelen teleporter open. So this is one I can fight whenever I want. Have I actually learned this fight? Also, I haven't learned my hero's configuration here. Uh, well, <laughs> let's hope this goes well. What is your name? Like, what do you go by at the top of the screen? You are the Legion. Okay, that's what I couldn't remember. 
Alright, I don't have a Sir Stinger this time. I do have Prismatic Spectrum. I was way too far away for that, so that's no good. Also, right, Valkyrie can attack upward. That does those things. Wait, if I just stay calm in this battle, it's not that bad. Just stay calm, kill the smallest thing available always, and uh, focus on dodging mostly. Focus on dodging mostly, stay calm, kill the smallest thing available. That's that's the key, probably. I need to get out of this little space. Yeah, you come to me. Now you're gonna do a bone slam and a couple of curse bolts, that's fine. You're gonna do the same. Uh, you were boning in a way I wasn't ready for. Alright, here come little boys. I will use my prism on them. Whoops, well, I'll try at least. Okay, so I guess I'm going for Bjarth. I can totally do that. That's fine. You're pretty much dead. I accepted a hit there, which I probably shouldn't have. That one was just me not bothering to do anything about it. Okay, little ones. Go down. Oh, jeez. Right, now there's a whole bunch of you. Ah, uh, okay, right. So Bjarth's death summons more little skeletons, so I really do need to leave him alone until the... Until the board is clean. Okay, so probably losing this one based on how this is going now. There's potential for turnaround here. Let's see if it actually happens. It might. Uh, whoops, I thought that was killing the, the bolt that was coming for me. I guess it missed somehow. Ooh, okay, I'm, I'm still alive somehow. I mean, I haven't died yet. There's potential here. 202, right, I life stole a whole lot from those. That was nice. I can just kind of sit here and chop up the soles of your feet. There's not much you can do about it. Okay, so ignore you, go for the little ones. Be careful of that prismatic spectrum. I'm... A lot of the hits I took there were because I was trying to, uh... Trying to use that spell. Ah, I okay. Well, I lived. I was. I, I wanted to spin kick off of the the thing. Shouldn't get that fancy with stuff. Keep it basic. All right, have a this. Uh, you're doing something. Okay, that. Cool. All right, you're gone. You can be too soon. Uh, I deliberately stopped damage so he wouldn't fall on me, but then I wasn't ready for his bone wave. Okay, that's fine. Uh, okay, well that was my brief little Valkyrie run. I might put it back on that, but... Or... Uh, mm, no. Two charismatic people, but I don't have any money. I got nothing from that. Hey, that's good for a quick boss kill. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on just a second. I gotta do something. Dragon Lancer versus jeez, I'm so speedy. Uh versus skeleton crew. Right, so that's how Dragon Lancer works. Uh Bastion will be good for this fight. I need to stick with Dragon Lancer for a while and do a real run. Yes, we are. You're gonna have a story to tell me first though. Oh, that can extend Oh is that how everybody here lives so long? I see. Hmm. Okay, really? I'm doing this? Apparently. <laughs> Alright then. <laughs> sure. Just because, like, this is a throwaway hero anyway. I might as well use use her up on, uh... Um... Whatever I'm doing here. Uh, so... Karelin. Yeah, so Dragon Lancer is about poking and then also flying sometimes. Just be in a comfortable poke spot. How do I... I guess I critical by flying, right, with the lance. Um, I have White Star, which is an interesting choice for this fight. So be far away when you cast a spell, if you feel like it. I guess the issue is if I succeed at this fight, then I still have kind of a throwaway hero here. Um, we won't get much else done. 
Ugh, oh, I'm so immobile while I'm using this lance. Oh, this class. Ugh, oh, does not agree with me. Ugh. Uh. Poke, poke, poke. Does that stop your cannonballs? It doesn't. Okay. Okay, so you summon that. Don't you summon... No, you have to go down a little bit in health before you'll call your boys. Ouch. Um. Ah. Ah. Oh, the immobility. I guess I'm supposed to move by... Flying, but then then I'm still immobile for a while before I can do that. Oh right, and I can't heal. That's useless. Ugh. No, I think I want to go back to my other plan of just finding a good contrarian dragon lancer or using the architect on a run where I have a blessing of might somewhere or something because like this weapon is just ugh. It does not work for me. It is extremely not my style. I don't think I'm even gonna get this fight done with it. It's that bad. Where are those skeletons? There they are. Oh, that thing's slow. Oh, it did nothing. Oh, also White Star is bad. Okay, I hate this hero. Yeah, and he's not gonna... She's not gonna get anything done. Ah. Yeah, this is just, this is unusable. Why does this class exist? Is this my new least favorite class? Might be. I mean, maybe if I work with it for a little longer, I could make it work, but right now, oh. Not even a little bit. That was a good dodge until a skeleton came in. Yeah, okay. Well, well, <laughs> yuck. Okay. Yeah, I would rather play a bard. I, uh, don't like the Dragon Lancer at all, so I'll hope for a good Contrarian to get that level up, because otherwise, how would this ever happen? Uh, enemies barely flinch when hit. That's not so bad. I rely on knockback rarely? Yeah, you know what? Valkyrie with gold bonus? That sounds fine. Kinetic Revolver, that's the name of the gun. Okay, by the way. I had a, had a question about that at some point. Okay, so Valkyrie will get a chance here. I won't have knockback, but that's... I can deal with that. That's fine, I think? Well, let's find out how much I rely on knockback. We'll find out next time, I guess. How much damage are you doing? That much. Same as last one, of course, because it didn't change anything.